Hey everyone, welcome back to ITVST. Today I am going to show you 7 Google Sheets features that will instantly make your daily work faster and smoother. Whether you are tracking tasks, analyzing data or managing reports, these features will save you time every single day. Let's dive in. Let's start simple. The first feature is checkboxes. In this sheet, I am going to list all my daily tasks like watering plants, pay electricity bill, grocery shopping and workout. Let's quickly fill this sheet with all the items. Now I have my daily tasks sheet. In this sheet, I have mentioned tasks in one column and done in another column. Now how do we add checkboxes? Simply just click on the cell that you wanted to add the checkbox and click on insert. As you can see, here you can find the checkbox. As soon as you click on it, a checkbox appears. And you can simply drag it down till your item ends. Just by inserting this checkbox, you can simply manage all your tasks and improve your productivity. Now comes the second feature. If you have been following the channel, you already know that I have covered the drop down menus in detail in another video. So instead of repeating that here, I will drop the link in the info card where you can see on the top right corner. Make sure you check it out and learn how to create clean clickable drop downs for things like task status, categories or priorities. Alright, let's move on to the next feature. Now the third feature which is nothing but conditional formatting. Think of it like a smart highlighter. Google Sheets can color the cells for you based on the rules so that key info stands out instantly. Let's take the budget tracker as an example. I will include the tracker so that I can demonstrate it easily. So here is my budget tracker and I want to see the items which I have spent more than 2000 by using conditional formatting. To make this happen you should click on the spending column and click on format you can see the conditional formatting as soon as you click on it you can see the conditional format rules here I want to check the budget which exceeds 2000 which is nothing but greater than and the value should be 2000 and I want to paint it as red when you click on done you can see the highlights which exceeds the amount 2000 it gives you the visual cues which is great for managing now let's move on to the next feature which is freeze rows and columns. If you want to freeze the row, it keeps the data headers visible while scrolling down and freezing columns means keeping the column visible while scrolling even sideways. I'll show you with a practical example. I have taken the attendance tracker as an example to perform the freezing function. As you can see, there are no columns or rows which are freezed. Even if I scroll down, the first row is disappearing along with the data. And even if I scroll sideways, the names are getting disappeared with the data. I don't want this to happen. So what will I do? I will freeze. Select the first row that you wanted to freeze. Click on view. Select the freeze option and click on one row. As soon as you click on one row, it automatically freezes the first row. Even if you scroll down, the first row will not move anywhere. Now let's freeze the column. For freezing the column, you have to select the desired column that you want to freeze and click on view and again select the freeze option. Now we will click on one column. It will automatically freeze the first column. Like this way, the first column will not move anywhere even if you move it sideways. No need to move back and forth to confirm the data. Now let's hop on to the next feature, which is version history. Have you ever accidentally deleted something important in your Google Sheets? Or worse, someone else messed it up in your shared file? That's exactly where version history becomes your safety net. Let's take a look at this medium tracker. In this sheet, you will see all the listed items of the articles, authors, publication date, reviewers and technical review statuses. We have perfectly filled out all the items but someone accidentally deletes everything. Like this. Normally that would be stressful right? But here's the good news. Google Sheets automatically tracks every change so you don't have to turn anything on or save anything manually. Here's how to use it. Click on file. You can see the version history. And when you click on the see version history, it will take you to this version history tab. You will see all the versions of this document. So you can carefully click on everything and see where your document has the data. In my case, I have here. I will click restore this version and as soon as you click on restore, 
it will give you all the data as it is you know why this feature is my favorite so we don't need to keep making separate copies of your file for every version you get transparency in shared documents and see who did what and when and most importantly it gives you peace of mind you can experiment freely knowing there's always a backup now let's move on to the next feature which is smart fill and formula suggestions this is a cool trick let's assume that you have all the employee ids and employee emails just like shown in this tracker so i need to complete these details by giving the first name and last name typically people would literally type each and every first name and last name and complete the sheet but using smart fill will help you save a lot of time the google sheet will automatically observe the structure and help you to fill the details faster i'll show you how see as soon as i type two names it automatically gave all the first names in that particular column if i accept the suggestion all the details are set same works for this see as soon as i type the first letter in the third row it gave all the last names from the email column it also suggests formulas as you type now let's move on to the last feature which is called column stats and it's exactly what it sound like let's say you're tracking number of steps with your friends and took each day this week now i will show you the sheet which we have come up with in this sheet i have names on the left and the steps that we have walked from monday to friday now instead of writing formulas for average total or range just right click on any column and choose column stats and this is how you do it i will select monday and when you click on data we can see column stats with just one click you will see a mini histogram all the values which is sum average median minimum and maximum values isn't this amazing when you are working with survey responses attendance numbers test scores budgets basically any list of numbers you don't need to write is equals to average or is equals to sum formulas just one click glance and go if you are someone who gets overwhelmed by formulas column stats is your best friend and that's a wrap seven powerful google sheets features each explained with real world examples you can relate to like this video if it helped subscribe for more google workspace productivity hacks and let me know in the comments which feature will you start using today thank you bye bye